he said, you guys are such a liar. No better than Sandoval. Because like, I said here when we were pulling it. He's not, now pull, he's literally. He said, pull up, please. But the lighting's good here. The lighting's good. You think this lighting's good? Why are you standing outside like a creep? Like a criminal. Because I am a criminal. <laughs> are you waiting for us, actually? Yeah, Michael, what do you mean? Michael Scarn. I don't know. Michael. There was a whole ordeal. Oh, spell it. Oh, it was, yeah, it was. Well, we pre-ordered because we're on. smart, intelligent girls, and then when Carly came back to the car with it, I said, this is wrong. Yeah, it was just this without any. It was literally just ice cream. Just ice cream. And that's you not have to ask for it Haley's way. Yeah, you have to ask for it Haley's way if you want Haley's Which is so funny because when Carly was like, she was like, I'm going to go see if I can like do it. What should I get for toppings? I was like, just get it how Haley does it. <laughs> yeah, and it's called and Haley's way. It's literally way. called Haley's way. Yeah. Well, otherwise, you just got soft just serve I, ice cream. Yeah. yeah. Who so. are you interviewing today? Kathy Kelly from WWE. Another WWE. -er. Are you the next Joe Rogan? I am. My oh, friend invited me. Yum. It's as soft as a cloud. I did see um, Reggie and Taylor try it, and I'm a little nervous because they're like, it tastes really healthy, which sounds like something I would say. Girls' day. First off, smell it phenomenal. It smells so good. It smells like smelled, peanut butter. I haven't smelled peanut butter in years. Guess the total. 900. <laughs> How Do you much? think it's more or less expensive than the smoothie? This better be less than a smoothie. It was thirty dollars for three of them, but I had to pay the difference. Oh, I was gonna ask if you. But like, it was lied. it was only six dollars for the difference. Six each. It's on me. Is it's Haley Bieber's? She yeah. made this. Okay, so do you know the lore of it? <laughs> Dude, tell me the lore. So she was one of the like founding smoothies. Founding that, father. She was the main one. She'd be on Route Mushmore. Route, yep. Route, Route Rushmore. Rushmore. Of Air One if they had one. She would. I think she was maybe like the third smoothie, but she was definitely the first that like was explosive. Yeah, catapulted them into the like Air One <gasps> sphere. Oh my god, Joe. Sorry. <laughs> the the you you have ice cream in front of us and we're not eating it. Okay, Did you we'll try bite it. it? Not yet. Oh, you put it back? I'm gonna yeah, mix I had it a little. To. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna put it in my mouth. You're that not gonna introduce guy. me or anything? It's your self explanatory. <laughs> this is a joke. Wait, this is so good, but I do get it. The the chocolate chips are healthy. I think they're dark chocolate. Delicious. Are they dark chocolate? I feel like I'm. Yeah. yeah. I'm not a huge dark chocolate gal. Yeah, but when you get it with all the stuff. Mm -hmm. This does really feel tough. like it's hers. It's. <laughs> it tastes like Haley, what Haley Bieber <laughs> would taste like. So basically, she had a smoothie that's like the strawberry glaze smoothie or whatever, and then she turned it into like an mm. ice cream. Treat. This is phenomenal. Wait, this is really good. Yeah. Did you guys see Stephen Baldwin ask for prayers about Haley and Justin? Yeah. What's going what? on, guys? Wait, what? Mm. Mm -mm. Wait, we gotta back it up. <laughs> so their pastor, Haley and Justin's pastor, I believe he's a pastor, I don't know, posted <laughs> on his story asking for prayers for Justin and Haley and wrote this like long thing. They're like, they're members of this parish, blah, 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 blah. And then her dad posted it too. So everyone's like, what the fuck Wait, is going on? Or they're like, hey, don't post that. Right? That's what I was thinking. What prayers for what? Their marriage? No idea. Wait, tea. This is so good. No, for me and Joe to be thrilled about an Air One product is like groundbreaking, especially Joe. Wait, what was the cost of this one again? It was like $12 a piece, basically. That's fucked up. That's so expensive. <laughs> That's a lot. That's like how much I pay when I get, um, what's it called? Froyo. So I put so much shit in it. This is crazy. That's like one night at a hospital. <laughs> okay, I wish. No, it's not. I mean, one once I do that, like, every day. Give me one second, yeah. I'm like, oh, I'm paper got help. <laughs> I need as far as dinner. the froyo consistency, it's I pretty like delicious. It. I like it. It's, like, um, like, moussey. Yeah. Very moussey. It doesn't it just, taste... Like, melts. I don't think it tastes like it's super healthy or anything. No. No, I don't agree with that. It's so yummy. Okay, so it says, mm. organic coconut strawberry glaze soft serve, spread the love peanut butter drizzle, no sugar added chocolate chips. This is healthy. Okay, Joe. What I like about this, they don't put in all those like super little fillers of like, this is gonna Collagen. help your kidneys. This is gonna make your hair grow faster. This is just straight up ice cream, baby. I know. Not the kidneys. We could have just gone to Dairy Queen. <laughs> I did ask though, they did put collagen in this one. I said I need to have the titty. You did ask for it? Yeah. And colostrum. Oh, that's why I meant. <laughs> yeah. This it's is so delicious. delicious. We were there supposed we to do this tomorrow. Mm -hmm. But kind of thank God today because it is way nice outside and apparently it's going to rain tomorrow. Well, news broke and Joe was like mm -hmm. blowing us up during the podcast. I was so pissed you guys didn't answer. Well, we were recording our podcast. There was an emergency. And you knew that too. I even texted you 911 and you didn't pick up. I know. <laughs> My phone's on do not disturb. We called you the second that we could. Yeah. So what's the deal? Sandoval. Well, that happened, but then Brittany and Jax got divorced, and they're on that new show, The Valley, so you, is that going to be on the end of the season? Do you want to hear no, some new tea? 
Already? Ja well, you know, Jax has a bar. No. In the Already? <laughs> <laughs> Already? We talked to him like Jax. Okay, so if you don't know, today, this day in history, <laughs> Brittany Cartwright announced that her and Jax Taylor have separated. They're moving into separate houses. Yes. <laughs> but it's not a divorce. <laughs> Why are you laughing? What do you know? Yeah, she's already living in a separate house um, from him. But, um, yes, they're separating, not divorcing. She's, like, very religious, so I feel like something's... I mean, I don't know they're why she work ever got married it. to him, but, like, I would imagine that she's, like, we took a vow, you know? Right. Ugh. Um, and he has a bar in Studio City. She announced today that they're separating and they are hosting trivia, trivia together at Jax's bar tonight. Are you going? I kind of want to. How awkward. Wait, this is crazy. Yeah. We should all go. And I joked, I was like, it's all just publicity so people will go to trivia tonight. <laughs> is that? Because his bar is like trailing. What's his bar called? Jax's. <laughs> I wonder if it, it's like super crowded when they do trivia at night and stuff like oh, that. Oh, I don't know. They always work there together? No, I don't know when he, I went there one time he wasn't there. Was this in the same Instagram line? Like she announced her divorce and we're doing <laughs> and then right trivia after. together? <laughs> Is that what they did? No, I think she posted the thing on her story and then I'm sure Jax posted something about it. And then he posted. I think the bar. <laughs> the bar. The bar posted. Like Britney's, <laughs> sorry, Britney's posting on Instagram like we're separating and he's posting memes. Wow, I've actually been sticking to my diet goals and I'm feeling great. Girl Scouts, the fuck you are. <laughs> what else do we have coming up? Oh gosh. <sighs> Not uh, me. I won't go on again. I have Aaron and Mike Sheffer. That is coming out this week, so Ooh, get psyched. It's going to be fun. linked down below. Here we are. Just like, feels like yesterday. We were just having this conversation. <laughs> Better than Carly and Matt. Okay. Um, oh, I just got the voice of Megan. The horror movie, Megan. She's a voice actress. Oh. Her name is Jenna Davis. Cool. That'll be fun. The, like, horror movie? Yeah. she come as Megan in character? No. She's the voice actor. She she didn't play Megan. Wait, is Megan, like, a cartoon? She's a doll. This is so good. You should have her dress up as a doll. Yeah. I should. I'll ask her. I do have um, a Trump connect. Actually? <laughs> yeah. I feel like you have so many connects, but you're just holding out now, on what's me. What's your Trump connect? I just got a director who just responded to me. No way. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Woo! <laughs> Did you see the guy from Pillow Talk uh, duet in yes, your video? Yes. <laughs> Did you guys Wait, talk about we that? We forgot to talk about it. On oh, let's talk about it here. <sighs> that was so That's funny. Mike interrupted us. Well, he did it on purpose. L Lena the plug, Lena uh, the mom, DM me and she was like, oh, Pillow Talk is having a field day with this. And I was like, oh God. And I was like, is he going to be like mean? And uh -huh. she was like, no, he's just like funny and you know as a troll kind of. Oh yeah. I, I went was... to their Instagram and I was like, Carly, like your face is just their feed. And he's like, yeah, he was mad. Yeah. No, and I all, thought he was more playful funny. I there thought was, he, There's so many the porn comments, stars in the comments that were like, I had to do it again. <laughs> yeah, but also so many people were so mean. Yeah. No one knows who this podcast is. I'm like, yeah, okay, yeah. fine. Just That's not the point. We weren't like shitting on the podcast. No, we were actually thinking it's so funny. Yeah. Oh, they were talking about your pod. Okay, cool. Yeah. Yes. Because I thought they were talking shit on my no, podcast. No, they were like, they were who, like is this, who no. even is this well, maybe. girl? Actually, they were. They were. Actually, yeah. <laughs> who even is this girl? Did anyone fight on Good Influences today? Did anyone fight? Oh, I did get a little snippy with Matt. Oh, Whoa. yeah, you did. Spill it. Why? Because well, we were doing, like, ad reads there, which we never do. But, like, as I we ended, I picked up my phone, and then the news about she Jackson like, oh. Brittany came out. And then Did I spill it to you? No, you didn't tell me that. You told me the news about Raquel and Tom. But well, already... if you picked up, you I would have told you everything. <laughs> no, but I already knew the Raquel and Tom, so I saw it earlier. Um, but so then we had to like be good, and I'm like, oh my god, like sitting on my hands, freaking out. <laughs> and then it went over to Mike, who's on the other side, so to do a bit phone. of the ad read. Yes, yeah, so I went back to my okay. phone. Okay. And then it came over, and I was still on my phone, but Matt started again, and then I was like, oh, like I'm about to say, like, oh, sorry, like I was doing something, and he was like, they can see you. <laughs> And then I was like, I know, I didn't know you were going. <laughs> it was really funny. Because I was like trying to be like, oh, sorry, I didn't know yeah. you were going again. And then he just like cut me off. So then I got snappy. Don't fucking be, don't be snappy with me. I'll be snappy right back. Don't snap right back. Like Guys, band. go comment a snake emoji on Matt King's new photo. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Did, yeah, you tell, like... did you tell people to comment R.I.P. Matt? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, you're mint. Your mint is up here. Because <laughs> he got a trish on my Someone commented on Patricia's photo and says, rest right. in peace, Matt. <laughs> like a lot of comments on Patricia's post of them saying, R.I.P. Matt. 
<laughs> we didn't say that, right? We said snake emojis or something. <laughs> Did you? No, I didn't say that. <laughs> it was really funny. Though. Yeah, we were like, no, I would never say tell people to say that. <laughs> Your mint went. Oh. Yeah, soaring. <laughs> that is so funny. Then what did he say? Was he mad? No. No, he was just like, I'm confused. Yeah, and I'm like, me too. This is spicy. It's really hot. I like it until it gets chalky. Yeah. No, it would leave a mark on the ceiling. That's the problem with these. You think I care? What's the deal with these, like, professional lip readers reading celebrities' mouths and, like... People can do that. I feel like I'm pretty good at it, actually. If what? I turn down the volume and I look at someone's mouth, I feel like I can, a lot of the times, kind of see what they're saying. You said, what the fuck? But I also heard you. <laughs> <laughs> Yesterday I went to the mall. Yeah. Wait, what's this I need you to do it again. I can't tell. <laughs> I don't enunciate it a little bit better. You're a stupid little bitch. <laughs> <gasps> oh, shoot. Go close my frunk. I don't want to do that. You guys are going to leave without Go me. Go close my fucking frunk. Do you guys remember Hollywood Fix? Do they still do that oh. thing where they run around? Like, I don't know, but there's so many now on TikTok. I follow this guy. His name is Joy of Everything. And he used to work for TMZ, but he doesn't anymore. And he's like all about like finding celebrities, but he's not rude or in their face about it whatsoever. He usually does like award shows. You gotta shows send it to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you guys want to see something crazy? Yeah. <laughs> Is it a sonogram? Better. <laughs> this is when I first moved to LA. Better? I would go on Craigslist and I would respond to all paparazzi celebrity photographer ads because <laughs> I wanted to try and do it. Oh. Could you like, imagine if you became that? That'd be so sick. That's so funny. If I would have started Hollywood Fix before he did. Is that guy walking a wolf? <laughs> yeah, what if you did it but just for us? I could do that. Like, that'd be so funny if you like, just, like, create stayed outside our house, but we didn't know when you were there, and you just, like... <laughs> that's hilarious, and you just create a new YouTube channel that's, you, like, no one knows it's you. You just hear, snap, 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 snap. That is Yeah, like, I'm just so... leaving to get a coffee in the morning. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> but, like, you don't do it consistently. Yeah, it's no, just, it's, like, a we surprise. don't know. And sometimes we look like shit. Yeah. Sometimes well, majority, most we're of the time. we're looking good. I don't, I think, like, probably, like, 90, 10, I leave the house looking like shit. Yeah. 10% <laughs> I look presentable. Yeah. Guys, Nine. this is like a bit a podcast. This is better than Good Influences, right? No, not better. I notice you guys don't comment on my TikToks. I don't really comment on anyone's TikToks. I don't really see your TikToks. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. Joe, I do think about that. I'm like, damn, he comments on everything. He's so supportive. And like, it almost makes me feel guilty because I'm like, I should be supportive. But then I'm like, but I just like, that's not me to like comment on people's TikToks. To like be that. supportive, friend. That's not no, like No, I'm you. supportive in different ways. In what way? Um, I show up. I go on your podcast a lot. I go on. I, I'm in your videos. You're in our videos. That is true, that is true. Yeah, those are valid points. Yeah. yeah, I'm just not someone who'll go on and be like, "Love this." Like I just. Why stop. it helps. I don't Guys, know. Guys, from now on, go comment on all my TikToks right now. Just I, go. I <laughs> just type AI stuff. Yeah, just do <laughs> this it. This looked great. But that just sugar crashed. That was crazy. Yeah, maybe that's what's happening to me. Yeah, I'm out of it. I need to get carbs. Oh, we ruined your podcast. I think you did. <laughs> to run you over. That's fine. <laughs> Guys, thanks so much for having me. My name's Joe. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye, Joe.